Today, Governor Bill Lee made a decision that could impact refugees coming to Tennessee in the new year. Now, the governor's signature now opens the door for refugees going through the State Department to resettle. A decision, that, a decision that's the first of its kind. Sam Luther joined us now with more. Sam. Well, Josh Kim, for the first time, some refugees may not be allowed to resettle in some states following an executive order from President Trump. Today, the governor of Tennessee said he's welcoming those coming to the country for the first time with open arms. Isn't this what this country is about? Local organizations like Bridge Refugee Services are relieved to hear the news Tennessee Governor Bill Lee supports more refugees resettling in Tennessee. Immigration attorney Martin Lester says Lee deserves recognition. I think that he deserves great thanks from not just the refugees, but from the people of Tennessee. But not everyone was pleased with the governor's decision. In fact, earlier this year, the Tennessee General Assembly fought against refugee health care in a 26-page appeal ultimately being dismissed by the Sixth Circuit for a lack of standing, but those opposed are still vocal. You know, they've already come out today, even after Governor Lee made this announcement to talk about why they still think that it was a bad idea. Even with the governor's approval, nothing is final yet. Each city and county must consent as well. Chattanooga Mayor Andy Burke already backs Lee's decision. So he has a very good understanding of our program, and he makes sure that he meets with the um, refugees who live in our community. For advocates, Governor Lee's decision wasn't a guarantee. For now, the door remains open for hope of refugees coming to Tennessee from all over the world. In a, a year when we've kind of heard nothing but bad news after bad news, as far as immigration is concerned, it was really really heartwarming to think we can end the year on a positive note. Now, the last step before everything is final is consent from County Mayor Jim Coppinger. Bridge tells me they expect to hear from him by Christmas. Kim. Sam, thank you. More than 20 other governors have consigned so far. For a full list of those who have, head to our website, newschannel9.com.